Legends, welcome to another episode of where I test every single car that I can find in Forza Horizon 4. In this episode I'll be testing the 2009 Audi RS6. It's a Class A 743 performance spec and it's all-wheel drive, so let's see how it stacks up in our tests. Some sleek lines, it's not too modern, but it's it's still a classic authentic Audi look, I would say. With a huge grill up front. <laughs> Alrighty, let's see how it does. Nice five cylinder sound. It's quite fast for a five cylinder, goodness me. Very cool. Is it a 5 cylinder or a V10? I'm not sure. Wow, it's a little bit heavy, um, but it's quick. Sheesh. Wow. A little bit of weird gear ratios. Don't like it that much. Responds well on the dirt. It just feels, again, just a little bit heavy. Yeah, it's certainly heavy. Don't like the weird gear ratios. Ooh, and when it gets on the grass, it's horrible. <laughs> don't work too well on this type of terrain. But as you can see, it's quite strong. Interior. Hmm. Nice visibility. Very cool analog dials, analog gale gauges. Feels quite good. Uh, it does feel a little bit, a little bit lazy. Loses a bit of grip there. Let's see if we can get past here. Wow, there it goes. Weird gear ratios, really strange. Feels a little bit claustrophobic. Everything's so close to your face. Let's see. Yeah, it loses grip. You give it an inch, it'll lose grip. It's kind of quiet as well. It's not that loud. Very luxury. Luxurious. <laughs> interesting, very interesting vehicle. Let's see how it does. Yeah, two minutes, 56 seconds, 0.8 as well. So, relatively quick for a class A, but mm, it can do better for sure. Weight reduction, a change of suspension, change of tires. It should be pretty good. It's got a strong engine. Oopsie. Wrong button. Wrong button. Wrong button. Alrighty, let's go for the cross-country event. I like the look of the car from the rear. It's very nice. I don't like the front that much, but it's not bad, but it's Mm. Alrighty, let's see how it does. It's got loads of power above 6000 RPM, you can just see it raise its, its nose. <laughs> mm. 
Yes, I'm quite right. Yes. <laughs> yeah, it's not great on on grass. Let's see what happens when I drive a bit faster. I mean, it's not bad. Suspension is a bit stiff. This type of terrain. Struggling a bit, but it's not bad again. in the red just because of the weird gear ratios see what I mean it's just like what Once you send it above 6,000 RPM, it just starts to build power like crazy. Come on. Exterior view, let's see. Let's get the engine above 6,000, and then you'll see what I mean. See, it just goes, whoa. Whatever is in front there is absolutely dominating. I guess it's that. Um, what's it? Alumi Craft um, race car. Class 10 race car. Probably that one. Because <laughs> that thing is built for cross country. Ooh, I understand. Get it back to power. potential for sure. Need to change the gearbox though. All the gear ratios. And weight. Yeah. Tie compound and suspension as well. 313.6. Mm. Mm. And yes, it was that Alumi Craft Class 10 race car. <laughs> now that thing. Tools for the job, guys. That's the way forward. All right, let's see how it does on a drag strip. Gear changes are slow, eh? Ooh. Lovely sound though. Sleek looking vehicle, it looks nice on the tarmac. Definitely quick. Heavy, certainly. 300 kilometers per hour. Wow. 
see how many gears it's got. Six. Yeah, it's got six. Amazing. So one minute and three seconds. Point two. Wow. Not bad for a class A. Not bad at all. Let's see. Final little, little test. Will it drift? I'm not too sure. Maybe. Strong engine, so it's a possibility. So much in third gear. Let's see. Huh? Nah. Not really. Doesn't like it that much. Unless you put a lot more power to it. There you go. Keep the engine above six. But you'll need quite a bit more power and reduce the weight. And Stiffen up the suspension a bit and change the tires. Maybe you could leave the tires as is, make it rear wheel drive. Should be a good drifter, not bad. And that's the 2009 Audi RS6. Hope you guys liked the video. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up. Um, yeah, subscribe if you want to see more content like this. And um, yeah, comment your thoughts below on this vehicle and. Um, in the video i'd love to hear it and as always all the best keep well and see you in the next one peace